Thank you, Mr. Chairman. I am so pleased to see that Mr. Green is a George Strait fan and has such an exciting ringtone on his phone, and I think that's a good, uh, good thing. Um, abusive patent letters have become an expensive part of a problem for businesses and for consumers across the country. The tactics cost our economy billions of dollars every year. They stifle innovation, particularly in Tennessee. According to an April 1st, 2015 article in the Tennessean, a record number of patents were issued by the U.S. Patent and Trade Office to Tennessee residents last year. We are very pleased with that. Needless to say, many of those are in the automotive industry, the healthcare informatics industry, and of course, the entertainment industry to bring wonderful individuals like Mr. Green, great ringtones from great artists like George Strait. The Tennessean article notes that raising capital continues to be a challenge for local startups and innovators. Innovators should be able to focus on getting their businesses off the ground rather than dealing with patent trolls looking to extort money from them. The targeting rogue and opaque letters act would crack down on the patent tolls by zeroing in on those persons who engage in a pattern our practice of sending demand letters and who act in bad faith when communicating or failing to communicate information within such correspondence. I thank the chairman, the staff, and other committee members who have worked on this and yield back my time.